So this is box number two that we picked up. And it is not easy looking through the camera and trying to open the box up. So we'll look over the top of the camera. So we'll this back open here. Again, I know no gloves, don't yell at me, people. I can't get all, uh, all those coins that I fell. So that one looks like it's old. This one right here. And that was the third roll in, so we're going to leave it the third roll in. I never, I know some people look, but I never look to see if I have circulated coins or not, because I've never experienced the uncirculated coins yet, I guess. So I guess one day when that happens to me, I will start in the box at the back. I guess the 2019s are coming out soon, so... Okay, so it looks like that one is probably an old coin, oldest coin in there, but I guess we'll see when we get there. So we'll do the same as we usually do, get through the top 10 ro rolls, get them laid out for you, and we'll be right back with you. Okay, so we're through the first 10 rolls, and we have... Two 1940 Philadelphias. This one right here looks to be in pretty good shape for a 1940. I can actually count four steps, almost four full steps, and another half step. So that's a pretty good find there, I do believe. That'll replace our 1940 in the book. So we'll put that back on top for now. And then we have a 1949 Denver. We have a 52 Philadelphia and a 58 Philadelphia, and we have three bison up there. So right now, out of that first 10 rolls, we ended up with five coins. We'll get through these next 10 rolls, and we'll come right back to you. Okay, so we're through 10 more rolls. That makes 20. And down here are the new additions. We have a 39 Philadelphia. That 40 Philadelphia has definitely had better days. It might go back to the bank. And we got two 41 Philadelphias, a 49 Philadelphia, a 54 Philadelphia, 55 Denver, 58 Denver. Hey, look, we found a 2009 Denver. I don't think we found a 2009 Denver in a while. Well, we haven't found a 2009 in a while, so definitely a welcome sight there to add to the collection. And we found us a 1943 Philadelphia War Nickel. So that'll be the first War Nickel of this box. So we will get through the next 10 rolls and we will come back and show you what we find. Okay, so we're through 30 rolls. And in that last 10 rolls, we added a big three coins here. So we got a 41 Philadelphia, 46 Philadelphia, and a 45 Denver to add to our coins that are up here. So we'll get through the next 10 and we will be right back with you. Okay, so this is the first roll after the last ones we opened and we're seeing a really thin edge right there. So I haven't split it open yet, I don't even know what it is. I'm gonna hold my finger there and see if we can look at it together here. Well, it is not I was hoping for a V nickel or a buffalo nickel. Instead, we got a nickel that you can hardly see. It looks like it's probably been metal detected. It looks like maybe 1975. So, it was definitely full on that. But as you can see, that looks like a really old edge. And we won't cut this out. I'll make sure and add this into the video. But, man fold on that one. Okay, we'll finish through these rolls and we'll get right back to you. Okay, so we're through 40 rolls, 10 left, and we're going to add a whopping three more coins. We had a 48 Philadelphia and 259 Denver's to add to our top line up there. So we will get through the next 10 rolls and we will be right back with you. Okay, so we are through the 50 rolls, box empty, and 
to our count, we have added two 1940 Philadelphias, a 48 Philadelphia, a 52 Philadelphia, a 53 Philadelphia, a 55 Denver, a 57 Denver, and a 58 Denver. So that's eight more coins. Let me get those added to the uh, top row up there, and we'll be right back with a recap. Okay, so here's a recap. We have a 1939 Philadelphia. We have five 1940 Philadelphias with that really nice one that's going to definitely replace the one in our book. We have 341 Philadelphias, a 46 Philadelphia. We have two 48 Philadelphias, a 49 Philadelphia, a 49 Denver. We have two 52 Philadelphias, 53 Philadelphia, 54 Philadelphia, three 55 Denvers, 57 Denver, two 58 Denvers, 58 Philadelphia, two 59 Philadelphias, that 2009 Denver, and then a 1943 Philadelphia one nickel. So I think I counted 27 coins. Uh, don't hold me to that, but that's what it looks like. And we do have these three 1960s coins right here that I'm going to look in our book and see if those will replace it. I think I got some pretty nice 1960-ish, 61, 62, and 64, I think are those dates. But I think I got some pretty nice ones in the book, so I don't know if those actually replace them or not, but I'll always set set ones aside I think we might replace them and then we have the bison to go through also I went through about that many already to see and still looking for that elusive speared bison anyway um, if you like the video please hit the like button if you haven't please subscribe share and uh, leave a comment and like I always say we will uh, answer everybody's comments if there's questions or just tell you thanks for commenting and we will see you next time.